Janelle, police say it was a video call the suspect made to a friend showing him the dead body of his girlfriend that prompted that friend to call police. When officers showed up to Miguel Rodriguez's home, that's when the five hour standoff began. Both be safe community. <laughs> but big bullet holes mark the window of this apartment on the 2000 block of Swar Run Road Monday morning. Neighbors say okay. they're shocked. This is a good place to live, you know what I mean? It's all neighborhoods good. But parts of the neighborhood had to be evacuated early Sunday morning after police say 38 year old Miguel Rodriguez barricaded himself in his Park City apartment for hours even exchanging gunfire with the county search team. Anytime there's, you know, gun violence or somebody kill, you know, it just is scary. Officers were there because earlier Rodriguez placed a video call to a friend and court papers say during that call, he showed the friend the body of his girlfriend. That friend then told police. Wow, that's, that's crazy, you know what I mean? Um, because this is a good place. CERT team members wounded Rodriguez and eventually took him into custody. After searching his apartment, police found the body of Nemesis Florentino and a voice recording of Rodriguez saying, quote, Hey, I love you. Forgive me for what I've done. I'm not turning myself into the police, and the police are there. Bye. Take care of my kids and all. State police and the district attorney's office are investigating the use of force against Rodriguez. He is charged with one felony count of criminal homicide. In Lancaster County, I'm Meredith Jorgensen, WGAL News 8.